hi you guys welcome back to my channel for another video i just got back from costco it's a million degrees and i have a summer costco haul to share with you guys i actually needed quite a bit of like cleaning and random stuff so that's what really drove the total up in this video. I think it was around 600 something dollars. Um, but it's been a while since I did a grocery haul, so I figured I would show you guys what I grabbed at Costco, some summer finds, a few new things that we've never tried before. So give me a thumbs up if you enjoy grocery hauls. I'm really debating on how many of them to include um, in my, on my channel going forward. So let me know if you like grocery hauls. Let me know what other food type content you guys really like seeing. It'll help me have some fresh ideas as we head into like the fall and this um, school year starting again. So I wanted to get on and give a little intro, but now I will show you guys what I grabbed at Costco in my most recent summer Costco All haul. Right. So we just got back from Costco and I spent $643 as you guys just saw. Um, this haul has a lot of like extra stuff that I don't ordinarily buy. And because it's literally 112 degrees outside, I did not have time to organize it because I need to get the food put away quickly. So we are gonna start here. I grabbed some dry erase markers for our upcoming school year. They have the best prices there. I saw these cotton shorts. Um, this is the brand here and i wanted them to be really loose and comfy so i got a bigger size than usual usually i'm a medium but hopefully those work i got protein bars syrup uh the kids have been asking for alfredo and i just don't have it in me to buy all the things to make it homemade um since i cannot enjoy it with them so i got this sauce to just put together something quickly for them um chopped onion the kinders or kinders um, seasoning blend that I love. I got some cinnamon raisin bagels, the best pistachios ever, um, some organic applesauce, the uh, unsalted cashews. In here we have four things of one pound each of ground turkey, turkey breast, and then this marinated beef um, chimchurri um, skirt steak. So I grabbed those. Down here, this is, this is the kind of stuff I'm talking about that I needed that is like extras. We were out of paper towels and toilet paper, so I got both of those. I needed some new sponges, so I have like a million. I won't be needing new sponges for a very long time. Um, I got a package of disinfecting wipes. That's another thing I don't buy all the time. Life Original Cereal. Um, a knife set. I never spend a lot of money on knives. It's just not something that I do. Uh, so every few years I need like a new set. So we needed these, some Eggo waffles, some peanut butter. Here I got some egg whites. These I've tried at Target, these mini cookies. They are gluten and grain free and keto friendly. It does say that they contain milk, um, but from what I gather it is um like not in large quantities so um i figured that these would be a nice treat for me they're really good and a tiny little bag at target is like five bucks so this was a great price my kids love these almond butter biscuits we are celebrating caleb's birthday and so i always let them choose out the drinks that they want to have so he chose these sparkling ice waters. So I got two of those. Gonna make a fruit platter. So we have the Tuscan style melons. Those are so, so good. Um, over here, we needed marinara sauce. This is my favorite brand, this white linen one. Cliff bars for the kids. Simple Mill almond flour crackers for me. Kodiak cakes for my family back there. This is my favorite gluten-free, dairy-free protein powder, um, but it is only good if you make a smoothie. Do not try to shake this with water. That's usually how I used to do my protein shakes, and I'm actually really sad because making a smoothie is so much more time-consuming than just putting some water in ice cubes and shaking it in a shaker. This, though, is disgusting like that, um, but it's really good in a smoothie, so... I like that one and it was on sale so I grabbed it. Another melon. Uh, we were out of laundry 
uh, pods. I like having these because my kids do their own laundry and it's just a lot easier to make sure that we're not doing too much soap or too little. Uh, there's the other thing of bagels. This is new. I've seen it and always wanted to try it. Um, this organic salad topper. It's basically seeds uh, that you put on top of your salads and I wanted to give it a try just for some added protein. So got that. Got these Archer grass-fed beef mini sticks. Boom Chicka Pop for my family. Um, late July chips. Uh, these are a new thing. We sampled these off the Eaton Path um, chickpea veggie crisps. Olivia can't have these because they have sweet potato, but they're made of real vegetables and they're gluten and dairy free and they're actually really good. Uh, some bread for my kids and then this is the, my favorite gluten free and dairy free bread, um, the Canyon Bakehouse. We got some spinach, we got some organic grapes, we got two things of strawberries, package of applewood, um, smoked bacon, a thing of rome romaine, the uncooked tortillas that my family loves, chicken tenders, and then chicken nuggets, the Just Bear brand, so good. So sad I can't eat those because those are really, really good. Um, the We needed butter, some sliced cheese, organic bananas. I needed some more storage bins. They didn't, I we try to get all the same ones and we have the larger ones, but my Costco didn't have those for whatever reason. So I just got this one pack. It's a pack of two, but they're like smaller. So that's that. And then I did grab a Summer Bridge activity book set for Landon um, and then one for Olivia. So grab those as well. So that is everything besides a case of bottled water that I got at Costco for $643. Uh, like I said, we needed a lot of things like laundry soap and uh, these kind of things and then like the knives and storage containers, markers, things I don't normally buy, which is definitely what made the total uh, what it was. But this is what I grabbed at Costco. So. Give me a thumbs up if you guys enjoy grocery hauls. Let me know if you have any questions down below. I hope you guys are doing well and I will see you all really soon.